My name is Valentina Vega Eck. I am an artist. This is a lot of fun for me, Luca, so you don't imagine. This is something that I wanted to do for a lot of time. I never do it. I don't have the energy. But I have now a reason to do it. I like my paintings, you know, I do. And I'm very glad that we opened them up because now I can examine them. I started doing paintings, probably because I was irate, curious about the whole world. I was always angry. And this, Lucas, is the one I did to get the anger out of my system for the war in Iraq, in Iraq. I was so mad that I painted this thing and it's called This Is Peace. It's La Paz. I couldn't do anything against George Bush, W. So the only thing that, to make me feel better inside, I did this painting and I did feel better. I discovered that doing some paintings, I would put some of the ideas that I had inside my head, like against maleness, for example. All the women I painted were pregnant because I was thinking very much on, on the mother goddess. The first gods men had was the mother, because it was a miracle that mothers could have babies. If you lived in a cave and suddenly some women had babies, that was awesome, come on. Really, the earth is a female that gives seeds, grows, explodes, and kills. Is the, the, the mother is the owner of everything. But I think this is Mother Nature. That's my idea. And she's surrounded with, by seeds and is opposed to mechanical, I think. They look very organic to me, but what? <coughs> I went to the Columbus College of Arts and Design in Columbus, Ohio, my alma mater. And I was 37, come on. So I took myself serious at that time. And I had Paula and Eduardo to, to raise. I mean, I took everybody everywhere and back. I started ceramics at college. And then I continued doing ceramics all my life, actually. I did a lot of pots with a wheel. What happened that one day I, dis I started doing figures. And they were so, I liked them so much that I decided to go on that, doing that. It was like a, a, a discovery. In Greek, in Greek mythology, you have the souls of people that die. They don't go to heaven, but they, they go to a place where the dead are. But in order to be there, they, first they have to have, when you die, if you're a, a Greek or a Roman, your children put a, a piece of gold or a, a coin in your mouth so you can pay the boat rower that will row you up to the other side of the river. So I changed this, the river for, or, or the boat for a an, an, uh, cart. <laughs> It's blooming, look at this, Lucas. 
which doesn't mean at all that we're going to have fruit because we don't have bees to do the work. Ah, oh, I don't know why I do art. It's something that I feel I have to do. And every time I'm, I'm having an idea, I, and I imagine how to do it in a painting or in a sculpture. I, I, want, I want to do art. I, and I cannot do it. I cannot even draw now. I break everything. Things fall down from my hands. I don't have strength in them. In, when I go up, I'm out of air. I, I, don't, I don't want any more of that. <laughs> See, this, this is the first that I made with the, uh, what's his name, the, um, I, uh, mistletoe. Uh, because the mistletoe grows inside the tree and comes out in the tree and destroys the tree. It's a parasite. And it has beautiful flowers. Nothing comes out the way I want, nothing. So I don't do it because I get angry with myself. And I decided to be Buddha, Buddha, Buddha after I, I became old. I prefer to be a um, balanced old lady and with a happy heart. I'm happy with my life, really. I think I did a lot of things that I wanted to do. I rode a camel, come on. I have some uh, periods of my life that I could cut out as you cut pieces of your movie. But I had a very nice life. I am a happy woman. Happy woman. <laughs> happy woman. <laughs>